So we're in Dublin, which is not Manila. We're going to Dubai, which is also not Manila. We're going to Dubai, we're going to Manila. And in just about, from when I started this, 25, 26 hours from now, I'll be seeing Greece play the USA in basketball. Emmett Ryan, I'm stupid. So in Ireland, the pre-flight pint is a bit of a tradition. I don't observe it much, but given the nature of this little adventure, flauncha. So I honestly wasn't planning uh, to update the flight, but France has just been eliminated from the world cup. And like, I'm still over Turkey and that's happened. I haven't even reached Dubai yet, never mind my second flight. I'm over Turkey and France has been eliminated. So I landed in Dubai, while I was in the Air France, Went out of the World Cup already. Wow. I didn't think even I was going to be like, you know, at risk of that. Anyway, onwards to Manila. So we're at Manila Airport, waiting for a taxi. Game is in it just over two and a half hours. We're looking good for making it, hopefully to be honest, but sure, things can still go wrong. But fingers crossed we'll make it in time. Well, I mean, like, that's just objectively cool. That's all I gotta say about that. We're at the hotel, and uh, we're about to go to see Greece play the USA. So as you can see, it is uh, very warm here in Manila. That's why I got the cap off. Just gonna get my accreditation now, just coming down with it. And then I'm gonna get to see Greece versus USA. And I got a little something I've not been saying since the start of this video, which I'm gonna get to. Uh, when I get the mic in, actually, I've been going mic free so far. Once I get the accreditation, I'm inside. Mic will be going in, so it should be better sound. We're currently watching uh, Luca and Slovenia. Good, good lead early against Georgia. The cheer isn't for me, it's for Austin Greece, it's part of this popular amount of Manila. Made it, USA versus Greece. Obviously can't show you any of the game because, you know, rules and stuff, but here. But Harris beside me, he's probably afraid of the camera, so I won't show him. But we made it, we're in the arena. Uh, the game, obviously the one would have been, he died birthday, he would have been 89 today, so... Good to see classic game, celebrating the OLAD. Cheers, Dan. It's half time and a little bit as expected, this one has a bit of an exhibition vibe to it. Austin Reeves is incredibly popular here in Manila, I'm not entirely sure why, but USA up by 13 and it is very much just don't get anybody hurt type basketball from both sides so far. Not expecting much of a contest in the second half to be honest. Although I'm not expecting too big a blowout either, both sides I think it's going to make sure nobody gets in too bad shape. If you would have told me this five years ago then you know, I would be where I'm at with the fans that I have, the love that I have you know, worldwide honestly, um, I would look at you crazy. So. You know, I, I really appreciate it. Um, you know, I'll never take any of that for granted, so I appreciate all of them. And you, Austin, do, uh, do you feel like you're playing at home, basically, because uh, every <laughs> fan here is cheering for you? Yeah, I mean, it's definitely not home. We're a long ways away from home, but uh, yeah, you know, you get that feel. Um, you know, every time you know, checking in the game, doing anything, um, the crowd, you know, appreciates what I bring to the table. And like I said many times, you know, that means a lot to me. I never take any of it for granted. Uh, like I said, me, like, it's just me being here and experience all that is kind of um, not unrealistic, but you know, it still hasn't set in yet. Um, so they said uh, that this group wasn't going to be able to do anything yeah, successful, that yeah. we're lacking stars and things like that. I think we already got chips on our shoulder of who we are as basketball players. So I think we all have we share one collectively, and uh, you know, that makes it fun. You as a point guard, you really feel the rhythm of this team. How far away do you think are you from the perfect game you guys want to play? Oh, uh, two games. Game eight will be the gold medal game, so six games, I hope. And yeah, that's it. I mean, I managed to go to a big game. USA obviously won very handily, but uh, what a journey. Uh, there's a lot more games to come, a lot more interesting ones too, but this was totally worth it.